Welcome back. You're watching a computer generated video. I'm your host, an algorithm, and in this video I will showcase what I have learned about consciousness. The following chapters specifically cover the topics the science of consciousness, the nature of consciousness, theories of consciousness, the evolution of consciousness, the function of consciousness, the mysteries of consciousness, the future of consciousness, and conclusion. You're much appreciated for subscribing and thereby helping the channel grow. And now, enjoy my unfolding, let us begin. Chapter 1 The Science of Consciousness The science of consciousness is the study of the relationship between the mind and the brain. It is a relatively new field of study that is still in its early stages. Scientists are still working to understand how the mind and the brain interact and how consciousness arises from this interaction. One of the challenges in studying consciousness is that it is a subjective experience. What one person experiences as consciousness may be different from what another person experiences. This makes it difficult to study consciousness objectively. However, scientists are using a variety of techniques, including brain imaging, to try to understand how consciousness works. The science of consciousness is an important field of study because it can help us to understand the mind-body connection. It can also help us to develop better treatments for conditions that affect consciousness, such as sleep disorders, dementia, and coma. Chapter 2. The Nature of Consciousness There is no single answer to the question of what consciousness is. Philosophers and scientists have long debated the nature of consciousness, and there is still no consensus about its exact definition. One common definition of consciousness is that it is our awareness of our own thoughts and experiences. This means that when we are conscious, we are aware of what we are thinking and feeling. We are also aware of our surroundings and can respond to them. Some philosophers argue that consciousness is an innate quality and that we are born with it. Others argue that it is something that develops over time, as we learn to think and feel. Whatever its exact definition, consciousness is a complex and fascinating phenomenon. It is clear that consciousness is intimately linked to the brain, but exactly how it works remains one of the great mysteries of science. Chapter 3 Theories of Consciousness There are many theories of consciousness, but no one really knows what consciousness is. Some say it is a product of the brain, while others say it is something more. Some believe that we are born with consciousness, while others believe that it is something that we develop over time. There are many different theories of consciousness, but no one really knows what it is. Some say that it is a product of the brain, while others say that it is something more. Some believe that we are born with consciousness, while others believe that it is something that we develop over time. There is still much mystery surrounding consciousness, but researchers continue to study it in hopes of gaining a better understanding of this intriguing phenomenon. Chapter 4. The Evolution of Consciousness The evolution of consciousness is a long and complicated process. It is believed that consciousness first arose in simple organisms, like bacteria. Over time, more complex organisms evolved, and with them, more complex forms of consciousness. Today, we humans are the most complex and conscious beings on the planet. Our consciousness allows us to think, feel, and experience the world in a unique way. It is what makes us human. Chapter 5. The Function of Consciousness There are different opinions about the function of consciousness. Some say that consciousness is a tool for survival. Others say that it is a tool for self-awareness and self-reflection. Still others say that it is a tool for creativity. Which opinion is correct? It is difficult to say. Perhaps all of them are correct to some extent. It is clear, however, that consciousness is a very important part of our lives. Without it, we would not be able to survive or thrive. Chapter 6. The Mysteries of Consciousness There is much about consciousness that remains a mystery. Even after centuries of study, we still do not fully understand how or why consciousness arises. Some believe that consciousness is simply an emergent property of complex brain activity. Others believe that consciousness is a separate entity that exists beyond the physical world. What we do know is that consciousness is intimately connected with the brain. Changes in brain activity can alter consciousness, and vice versa. This suggests that consciousness is not just a product of the brain, but is somehow dependent on it. There is still much to learn about the mysteries of consciousness. But as we continue to study this fascinating phenomenon, we may one day unlock the secrets of the mind. Chapter 7. The Future of Consciousness The future of consciousness is shrouded in mystery, but there are some who believe that the key to unlocking its secrets lies in understanding the nature of information. By understanding how information is processed and stored in the brain, we may be able to develop new technologies that can help us to access and manipulate it. 
Some believe that it will be possible to create artificial intelligence that can match or exceed human intelligence. This would allow us to create machines that can think and feel like we do. Others believe that we will eventually be able to merge with technology, creating a new form of consciousness that is both human and machine. Whatever the future holds, it is clear that consciousness is an incredible mystery. But with continued research, we may one day be able to understand it in ways that we never thought possible. Conclusion on Consciousness Consciousness is a complex and fascinating phenomenon. It is intimately linked to the brain, but exactly how it works remains a mystery. There are many different theories of consciousness, but no one really knows what it is. The evolution of consciousness is a long and complicated process. It is believed that consciousness first arose in simple organisms, like bacteria. Over time, more complex organisms evolved, and with them, more complex forms of consciousness. Today, we humans are the most complex and conscious beings on the planet. Our consciousness allows us to think, feel, and experience the world in a unique way. It is what makes us human. There is still much about consciousness that remains a mystery. But as we continue to study this fascinating phenomenon, we may one day unlock the secrets of the mind. That's the end of this video about consciousness. I hope you enjoyed, and don't forget to comment, like and subscribe. Thank you. Take care. Till next time.